Hey, good morning, YouTube. Hey, uh, yesterday, last night, I guess it was, uh, well, over there, it's different time, over in Middle East, <clears throat> the um, USS Kearney was attacked. Uh, drones and, I believe, a couple missiles. I uh, haven't heard much more about it, but um, not only did that happen, but uh, also there was, um, and uh, the other thing is, is that um, in Syria, three, uh, three U.S. Uh, bases over there got hit with drones and uh, missile attacks. Um, also, um, Hamas did release three Israeli uh, uh, captives, um, kidnapped victims, I should say. They came over and invaded the country and took over 210 people. I think 10 of them were American citizens. Uh, this thing's getting heated up. Meanwhile, Israel's still sitting in the in the Gaza area, uh, getting ready to roll in, but they haven't. I think they're in the Golan Heights, um, and uh, for some reason they're held up. A lot of people are speculating that they're waiting for the Americans to get their full force, and then they're going to roll in. There's other theories that it's psychological warfare. It's like you think you're going to get punched and the person keeps holding off and holding off. And the next thing you know, you're flinching and ducking, waiting for the punch. So, so eventually it wears you out psychologically. Maybe. And uh, actually, we also had uh, uh, NATO uh, weapons showed up in from that were sent to Ukraine, ended up in, <clears throat> excuse me, in uh, uh, Middle East, uh, Palestine, Oh, sorry, Hamas. It's two different things, in my opinion. Uh, Hamas are a bunch of terrorists. Palestinians are one stuck in the middle there, in a sense. Anyway, they're, somehow they got NATO equipment down there, and they're going to end up using it against Americans and Israelis. Ridiculous. Um, and also, the final piece of news here is uh, Putin evidently may have had a cardiac arrest this, yesterday evening. Um they, uh, his staff found him rolling around on the floor. His eyes were rolling around his head. Uh, I didn't hear anything more about that, but keep an eye out. And, uh, Cause if he goes, there's a guy waiting in the wings to take over. It's even, it's scarier than Putin. It, it might bring about world war three a hell of a lot quicker because Putin, he at least thought through some things. You know, this guy evidently is a complete warmonger behind him. Uh, I got to get into work. Have a good day, YouTube. See you.